be joined by Bo Morgan. Bo, twig off the mark there, a very comfortable performance. Nice, but he travelled so well. Coming down the hill, I, looking at it, watching it, I thought, you must have a good chance. Just beaten by a very good horse in the end, but yeah. there's lots to be excited about going forward now as well. Yeah, we were a bit unlucky at Cheltenham. Um, the race sort of fell apart for us a little bit. You know, we missed the last and he got left out in front. It's just it's a bit of a quirky horse when he gets out in front. And we were just a bit unlucky that day, but um, luckily we were, we, were, we were right today. Just for you, it's your first winner under rules as a conditional. Yes. How's the move been to Ben's and how's it all going for you at the moment? Yeah, it's brilliant. You know, Ben's is an amazing place. Uh, the New Yards is uh, phenomenal. Um, but yeah, it's all going really well. He's given me lots of opportunities and I'm really thankful. And Big Brother Luke is most, probably one of the most experienced conditionals in the weighing room. What's it like as well? He must be like a second jockey coach to go alongside Roddy yeah. Green for you as well. Yeah, he is brilliant. Um, taught me basically everything I know so he's a massive help as well it's great to have him there I was looking into what um, could be next for Tweek I think mentioned your mum mentioned about River Don possibly at the yeah, Doncaster possibly possibly you know no, no second stone yet but you know we'll see how it goes and so you're finally looking into the rest of the season it's the case now of riding 87 pound not riding 87 pound claim of course but just getting as much experience as possible yeah, yeah, and just trying to get many contacts you know yeah just, just get around ride, ride when I can and 